this is this is a special moment for me. I've been we've been rocking on this show for almost ten years plus, and I never had this opportunity uh, to have the first person I fell in love with uh, in the studio with me. And um, this is my mother, uh, Jacqueline Gibson Reese, and, and she's rocking me here, straight straight up here from my from Birmingham, and a uh, lady that. Trust me, her and my father really directed me in, in so many uh, great ways, and she's she's a graduate of Miles College. She's rocking her, her Miles College, uh, <laughs> you know, alumni. You know, I, I, in the building. I'm not going to say what year, but she, she's an alumnus there, of course. And she's an alumnus also at University of Montevallo, Montevallo and several uh, courses in, uh, at the uh, University of Alabama in Birmingham. A uh, forty-plus year uh, educator in Jefferson County uh, uh, school system. Also adjunct professor at Miles College, her alma mater. So, and she she retired. She's been retired twice. And I, keep and, it going. And she rocking with us. Uh, Eighty five years young. Nice here, here in the sports yeah. shop. Welcome to the sports shop, Jacqueline G. Reese. What's up, mom? How you doing? Hello. How are you? <laughs> mom, how you doing today? Good. I am doing fantastic. Uh-huh. I am in the audience with my son, uh-huh. my friend yes. Pam. And my friend Comac. <laughs> yeah. Pam, I Pam, get to be your friend. To be here yeah. today. Mama, yeah. you can't trust Pam. Don't, don't, you can't don't, trust you Pam. Can't trust Pam. Well, don't. I, well, I've got to trust her because she's her same gender. Oh, okay, okay, <laughs> all right, okay. We'll let that slide. Well, well yes, Mama, yes. I know you, 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 you've you been watching us, me and KMAC, for a long time. And then Pam, she always asks about you because she wants you to come down to Mount Pilgrim Baptist Church at some point right. and, and do the Women's Day I down there. Right. And so, I, I already <laughs> mentioned that. Uh, to my first lady, I'm ready. and she said we're going to get together. Okay. So, mom, let's, let's oh, get in real quickly. I, I, I want to talk about education. To talk about talk about your years as an educator and some of the things that you were most happy about. I am first. I am most happy to have been uh, to be here with my son, mm-hmm. uh, to whom I loved for uh, a many, 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 many years. <laughs> Ever since he, his existence mm-hmm. until this present time, I I feel so worthy and so good to be in the studio with you all today. Okay. I bring you greetings from Birmingham, Alabama. Okay. Pleasant Grove, a little <laughs> place on the outside of Birmingham. <laughs> but uh, the hell. it's where I reside. <laughs> yeah. But I am a member of the old school, mm-hmm. and I am a graduate of Miles College. Yeah. Uh, don't let me say my age. My son just said it. I hope you didn't catch it, but I really don't feel 85. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't be it. <laughs> but, but I am a graduate of Miles College uh-huh. at the University of Al- uh, North of Montevallo, along uh-huh. with for the studies at uh, UAB. Uh-huh. I had thought at one time that I would pursue a PhD, but uh, I felt like it was my time and I could present to students through what I've already experienced and had. Mm-hmm. So I taught for a number of years and it was such a great, great experience. However, I would go back and do some sub work they asked me to come back and just babysit, <laughs> but I found out babysitting was just as hard as teaching. I know that's harder. <laughs> so with that in that's mind, yeah. uh, I am so <laughs> thankful for my years that I did teach and mm-hmm. those years that I was a member of the educational system. Mm. Uh, I have found a great many things today that I would do mm-hmm. Uh, that I found out with students in 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 Alabama, it was reported last year that there were twenty three thousand teachers that retired, mm. and many of them quit. Mm. You know that's history mm-hmm. because uh, some of the reasons that they decide to retire was student behavior. Mm. Well, let's go back to the mm-hmm. pound. Parents, yeah. mm. you know, the first teacher that a child, well, the first teacher is their home and their mother mm-hmm. and their father, if there's one in the right, home. Right, right, right. But we are, uh, we're looking and 
hoping that more men would yeah. take authority over their children, mm. even though they might be in a single uh, house or whatever. Mm -hmm. But yeah. in my in my doing, I yeah. have just greatly am loved. I love teaching. Well, Mom, that's that's uh, that. Obviously, I I, I see that all my life. I think Pam and uh, Takima got a couple questions, right? Quick. Yeah. So before we go, we yeah. want you know this <laughs> this is my story, Earl Travis Reese yeah. segment. Um. So like a lot of icebreakers, they say, tell me something that we wouldn't ordinarily know about you. So tell us something oh, about this man right here uh -huh. that we would not ordinarily real quick, know. Real quick. Uh, uh, he's humble. He's kind. He loves sports. I was so elated to see him in the position that he loved and that's his sports. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, of course, when he was in school, and let me get, tell you something. Real quick, mama, real quick. Real now. quick. He yeah. went to Alabama A&M. Yeah. And his first year, mama, daddy, they didn't they didn't choose me right then. <laughs> so you're going to have to go buy me some cleats. <laughs> <laughs> we went and bought cleats, and he went back That's down funny. to Alabama and them, and he got on the field that particular day. So that's the thing okay. that no right. one Okay, man, what you got? Because she, oh, she's going to talk too much. <laughs> we thought he started at everything right away. Well, no, no, I didn't no, start as a freshman. No, no, so, I was a freshman. So, I didn't start as a freshman. So I've heard this story many times. The reason that we travel all over the country, all over the place, many places, who really had the piano lessons? Did he have them? Or did he say, who had the piano lesson? Because he swears he had the lessons. Uh, it was him. Aha! Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute now. No, no. Not, I, I said not, Jack, <laughs> Jack Reese had okay. the lessons. Uh, Jack Reese had the lessons. Right, okay. right. Get but it right. He was just picking it up and he would really just play uh, on nothing, really. But he, he just wanted to be. He wanted to be like his sister did. He loved. Oh yeah. Uh, now he loved playing the piano. He loves to play the piano. I got one last question yeah. about Reese. Can you tell us a little something about Natural High Explosion? The band was saying, <laughs> making all that noise. They, they were making like what twenty five dollars. Okay, let me tell you how that started in my backyard. <laughs> in the backyard. In the backyard, it all started with some of his. Uh, <laughs> boys in the community. Yeah. And he just loved it. And every time you turn around you hear him say moon 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 That's not right. That's not right. <laughs> but anyway, he loves his piano <laughs> and he loves his those oh, persons boy. that yeah. have been with him yeah. through the years. Yeah, yeah. Right. Mm. Uh some of them now are deceased, yeah. but we thank God for him still being here playing on the piano, and he loves it mm. to go. I love to see him going swaying back and back forth <laughs> because <laughs> I feel like it's a part of him. Wow. Right. It, it is part right. of him, right. and we make a lot of money sometimes, don't we? <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. So last question yeah. for me, yeah. real quickly. Now, it's just between me and you. Now, he he, he cook all right. He, he do pretty good. But now his oh. potato salad. Mama, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we won't what? talk about the potato salad. Okay, I good. We won't even talk about it. Talk about it. Say, say it again, Mama. Fantastic. Mama, to the point where I go home, you, you ask me to make it. Mama, you can tell us. It, you know, you, Look, I'm not good. bragging now. <laughs> the taste is what tells the story. Right? And, and uh, I this haven't heard from anybody a, say anything against this. This is coming from a home ec teacher, an English mm -hmm. teacher, and so stuff. Home ec, so she, she, she's a great oh, cook, boy. too. Mom, we get we up against it, but uh, from, the, from the sports shop, yeah. we're so happy to have you here. It's a pleasure we're going to do this for, for the, uh, the Pam's mom and K-Match mama yeah. in town. But we love you. We appreciate you. And uh, give us a roll tie before you go. Roll tie. <laughs> Yeah. Roll. Yeah. roll tie, roll. Let me you give you, let you, me give you she one said. for Alabama for my scholars. Right. Go, Bears, go. Go, Bears, go. Go, Bears, go. Go, Bears, go. So y'all see where I got it from, right? <laughs> D.L. Reese came back. Pound Tom Smith the fur, A-Town. And our special guest, Mama Reese, man.